people often say that um, Pigopristis denticulata or Catoprion mento are piranhas. Um, I wanted your opinion to, to see um, why they sometimes are thought excluded or they're excluded from being in the piranha group. Okay, uh, scientifically, uh, there are members of the uh, Picopristis and Catoprion, as well as Metignis, are members of, the, of that uh, phylogenetic line. So, if you consider piranha as a, as a, as a name for, for the group uh, extensively, they need to be included. However, uh, the name of piranha uh, is an is a Indian, is an indigenous name applied to a, some sort of fish that uh, have the, uh, the uh, capacity or capability to, uh, to eat meat. And uh, uh, Catoprion and Pygopristis, although they uh, sometimes can uh, be uh, predators of other fish, they mainly are uh, omnivorous, one of them, uh, Pygopristis, and the other is uh, considered a parasitic fish, Catoprion, because commonly attack other fish, but uh, ingest principally scales. So it's not uh, uh, a carnivorous in the, in the strict sense, it's, uh, it's uh, what's called in, in science Lepidophagus. It's, a, it's an animal uh, adapted to eat scales of other, of other fish. That's the, the, the only reason. Uh, so you never are going to find uh, schools of uh, Pygopristis denticulata uh, with the same behavior of uh, Pagocentrus or uh, Cerosalmus. That's the only the only reason. And 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 the and the, uh, the mainly the, the separation uh, of, of of that group is is, uh, is a cultural separation, not a scientific separation. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, Antonio.